Hey guys, welcome to Yaz Vision Homestead. I'm Priscilla. If you're new, please subscribe, like, comment, share, and hit that bell notification for my next video. Guys, I am at Shop and Save. I've never been here before, but we're going to see what these prices look like. These flowers are absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, what my, my main goal is today is getting oil, getting cheaper meats, and just save, period. That's what I'm trying to do. But I do want to compare and see the prices from Walmart to here. So, so far I see that the vinegar is about the same price, $3.39. If you guys hear any music in the background, I do not own any copyrights. The music in the background. So they stem tomatoes are $2.99. They grape tomatoes are $2.99 as well. Then they got hydroponic tomatoes. They look pretty good over here. We are in the city today, guys. So yeah, the food may look a little better. I don't know. Look better than Walmart. Well, not this one. They don't look too good. But I do want to compare, guys. Their cabbage is 89 cent a pound. They do have food here. I will say that. All right, guys. So onions are 3.99. That is a lot, a lot of money for some onions. Bring it on. Now I did hear that there is a potato shortage. They are 3.99 for five pounds. In some stores, they are 9.99, 8.99. Very, very expensive. And this one came from Idaho. So I'm going to grab two bags of this. Make that 10 pounds of potatoes. These potatoes over here are $5.79. Then they do have this over here, a 20 pound bag. Well, I might get this. See, I think I'm gonna get this. But uncertified potatoes, I don't even know what that means. So, I don't know, y'all. It says country harvest. Maybe it's from the country. That's not too bad, though, for that price. But is it good? That's the question. All right, guys, we're gonna take our chances on these potatoes. Look like they're farm grown. So for $6.99, you cannot beat it. All right, guys, they do have celery, two for $3. And the lettuce, wow, $2.49 for lettuce, y'all. The artisan lettuce makes leaf lettuce, $5.99. The other one, romaine, is $4.99. So guys, try to grow your own lettuce. And peppers are $3.99 a pound, $5.99 a pound. The green peppers is $1.99 a pound. And then they also have the mini peppers for $4.99. We have some more potatoes over here. They are $4.99. I do want to get this. You get five pounds. So I love me some red potatoes. They have all these goodies here, y'all. Looks really good, but very expensive. This cheesecake, when I say it is bomb, it is bomb for $16.99, y'all. $16.99. Let's see. Ooh, look at this. Angel food cake. $5.99. I'm thinking about getting one of those. Let's think of something better over here. I actually love this type of bread over here. I don't know how much it costs. It's supposed to be a dollar, but it don't look like it. It looks like it's $2.29. Very expensive. I'm not paying that. I wait till I go to Walmart. Guys, they do have the Sweet Baby Rays, two for four. But their Red Hot, Frank's Red Hot, is two for seven, y'all. That's a big bottle, but that's a little too high for my blood. But I just wanted to show you their shelves and what it looks like. It looks like they push a lot of stuff to the front, which you can tell right here by looking over here. A lot of things are pushed to the front, but they do have food. I can say that myself. They do have food, and the mayonnaise is $2.99. What is that, Kraft? That's not too bad for mayonnaise. This is their vinegar over here. The vinegar over here is $4.39, $5.39, $3.29 for that little thing. Y'all are bugging. $2.49, yeah, I see inflation here. It is crazy. $7.29 for some apple cider vinegar. All right, guys, but now what we're going to do is pick up some meat. So all of this stuff looks like pork over here. So I am not messing with it. I'm going to see if they got something on the other side, y'all. All right, guys, over here we do have the 5 for 25. So the legs look pretty good as well as the thighs. Anytime you can find thighs for that price, that is a go. So we're going to pick up five things and see what we can come across. Now, this breast don't look too good. It does not. The thighs look pretty okay. And I'm going to go to the other side as well to see if I can find some hamburger meat, some steaks or something like that. All right, guys, over here. This is not too bad. Um, let's see if we can find some steak. Um, I'm probably going to try to get the heaviest one. And I do want to grab some of this chopped meat right here. So we're going to decide, y'all. As you can see, it is not much left. It's just like a, a pot roast. Yeah. Well, top round steak. It's going to be a pot roast in my house. All right, guys. So we decided to get two legs and three thighs so we're deciding now there's not much left it's like two left so i think he's gonna grab these two right here i picked this up at dollar general for a penny and i will say 
this is so good i'm so tempted to get this water but no i'm just gonna go hunt around dollar general and find some more pennies and family i'm excited they have some fish over here now this stuff over here i do not eat the shrimp is 15.99 what size is that i don't even know but that one over there is 15.99 this is 17.99 9.99 lobster 9.99 they crazy and then that says farm raised catfish i don't eat that either rainbow trout no go tilapia no cod no so i guess we ain't getting no seafood today what i was excited about was some whitings but they do not have any y'all do you see the prices of the fish like crazy now i will say the salmon looks pretty okay but it don't feel too cool over here so i wouldn't even dare to even try to pick it up and they have more stuff over here scallops and uh what is that Bay scallops, y'all, these prices are crazy. Very crazy. Yeah, even the crabs, $18.99. Too much, y'all. Alright, I do want to see what is going on. I want to see if I can find anything on sale. What is that? Veal shank. I don't eat that, so I'm not going to mess with it. All of this over here is pork, so I'm going to move right along. And look for my turkey stuff and my chicken. Yeah, this is all pork over here definitely all pork all right let's see what this steak is looking like we have the family pack strip steak for $16.36 $8.99 a pound yeah and you only get four then they have this over here the mini steak for $8.96 I think it's $6.79 a pound family yeah way too much for my blood way too much that one is nine dollars that's the chuck tender steaks for $9.90 three and they are 6.49 a pound yes they are now this is not too bad ten dollars i don't think that's too bad for the boneless chuck steak and i think it is 6.99 a pound but me and him we're gonna have, definitely have to talk this over because no that's just the meat y'all it's, it's killing us it's killing everybody i know it's insane even the small uh what is this new york strip it looks like to me 6.43 9.19 a pound yes this is real real these are real prices this is why i do this videos guys so i can show you all the prices in my area this is what my area looks like you know i'm giving you my my opinion of my area so they also have some ribeye that is 15.52 two pieces for 16.69 a pound yes would you ever think mm -mm, we ain't getting no steak today not from here they done lost their mind mm -mm. you better off just getting one little piece this is like a <laughs> what do you call it? I don't even know. A treat? Then they have some filet mignon for $18.49. We know that's going to be expensive. But yeah. Mm -mm. And what is this? Alright, this is not too bad for like two people. Not too bad. $6.49, $6.69 a pound. So I have to get two of them to fulfill my household. Yeah, no, I always go through stuff. This one is the cheaper one. So I'm going to try to find the cheaper one. If I could pay $10 for both of those, that's not bad. Yeah, I actually could do it. I could do it, y'all. Wait, hold on. Let's compare. Yeah, no, I like comparing. I like to compare. What's this one up here? $582. That's not too bad. Like, what, $12 for this? Yeah. So our goal today is to get meat, y'all. That is what we're doing today. Get some meat. And let me see what else that is way too much i am not messing with that at all let me see if i can find anything down here real fast um royal they have some royal right here 608 6.99 a pound i need it to be a lot thicker than that because who is this feeding nobody no i'm not happy with that so we're gonna move right along and we have the bottom round roast $23, y'all. Mm -mm, we need a smaller piece. English shoulder roast, $10. Let's see. That might be a good price. I don't know. Let's see. That might be a good price. It's a shoulder roast. I never got that before. But, you know, I'm into trying new things. It's fine. It's a bigger one for $11. I like the way this one looks. I don't like the way this one looks. It looks too much, like too much fat. That one looks like less fat. So on this occasion, I'm going to go ahead and splurge on that. And then they also have some 
stew meat right here. That's not too bad. I told you my family does not eat a lot of meat. So these are not too bad prices right here. They are $6.19 a pound. So here we go. They got our beef stockpile right there. And their chopped meat is ridiculous. It really is. It's crazy. So we got our chicken and Henry's bringing over our beef right here. All right, they do have some chopped meat here for $10. Um, I think it's three pounds. So I would usually spend like, what, $15 on this. If I get this, I would break this up. This is 80-20, which is not too bad. Um, some things I'm gonna save for Walmart because, you know, Walmart got some things that I like and that I really need. And I don't think I'm gonna get this breast. They are 16, 15, 17 dollars. We're gonna go to Walmart and get our breasts and their wings. Let's see what they looking like. 16.99 and they are 4.49 a pound. 16.77. The small one is 4.89. These are thighs. Oh, not too bad, not too bad. What about the small wings? Do they even have that? Let's see. All right, they do have the wings, but they're $9.91. No, thank you. We will wait to go to Walmart. Yeah, they go some more prices. Eight and change, huh? Yeah, like, now I'd rather get the whole tray. The tray and then break it down. I'd rather do that. All right, guys, so this is what it's looking like in my area. And the whole chickens, $8.79, $9, $1.49 a pound. These are rather big chickens, so I will say that. Yeah, I'd rather bigger chickens than I usually get. All right, y'all, let's look around the rest of the store and let's see what's going on. They have some chicken wings for $10. I think we should get three bags, because, uh, you know, chicken hey. wings is ridiculous. All right, guys, over here they have the Lunchables. Uh, where are the cheaper ones? $179. Mm. They done lost their mind. Where's the lunch mates? Am I looking at lunch mates? No. Lunch makers, 179. No, thank you. We will go to Walmart. Now I do want to get some lunch meat over here. 499 is not too bad. It was 699, so I'm gonna probably get like about four of those for the children. You know, they homeschool y'all, but we always look for a cheaper price all the time. You know that. And then the cheapest one that I see is this right here. So I'm gonna get some turkey and I wish they had chicken. I don't really even see the chicken at all. Guys, so we're gonna pick up this one right here. So $10 for me, and then we have the honey smoke right here. Guys, look how much the bacon is, $9.99. They are crazy, $6.99. I do not eat that, I eat turkey bacon. Like crazy, y'all, $13.49. If I did eat this stuff, I would not eat it anymore, because <laughs> who's paying that? No, like crazy. Yeah, uh-uh. I ain't paying no $10 for no Mm-mm, no, I'm not doing that. But they do have the turkey bacon right here, $4.99. I gotta see if Henry's into this, if he want that, or if he want the butterball. Guys, stock up on your water while you can. This is priced at $3.88 for a 32 count. So stock up on your water, family. Family, this is what their butter aisle looks like. They have blue bonnet for $1.99. That's not too bad. But I am looking for the Imperial Butter. They only have this kind here. So I will stick to my Dollar Tree, 125 or Dollar General. This is their eggs over here, 349 for large brown eggs, 599 for cage-free large brown eggs, 369 for a 12 count of extra large, 449 for 18 count, 440, 429 and 299. And this is what the biscuits and stuff look like. Guys, biscuits is out of control. Let me show you what is in my cart really fast. We stocked up on some chicken, some beef, and much as much as we can. Some chicken wings, some lunch meat, some potatoes, some water. They have these 10 for 10. Got some milk and some rolls and some fish. Very happy about this fish. So guys, if you like this video, you know what to do. Hit that like button, subscribe, comment, share, and all that good stuff.